What's up, Steph? What are you doing? Hey, I am grating sweet potatoes for a caramelized onion and sweet potato frittata. Does this mean I get to eat it for breakfast? Yes, it means you get to eat it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner because Ooh. we put no restrictions on the sweet potato frittata. That sounds amazing. <laughs> yeah, we love this recipe. So mm. let me show you what I'm doing. Basically, I'm taking a pie pan, and this is cool because unlike regular pie crusts, uh, this is gonna be gluten-free and only one ingredient. So, sweet potatoes, and what I put in here is coconut oil. And this is kind of fun because you get to be like a kid and use your hands. Uh, so we're greasing this pan with some coconut oil ahead of time so it doesn't stick. And then afterwards, you can use this coconut oil for some hand lotion. Yeah, so you can be glowy and moisturized while you're cooking. Pretty good, right? You can Brilliant. also use this in your hair, which it's awesome for. Um, so now we're gonna take our grated sweet potatoes, uh, which we did ahead of time, and we're just gonna put them right into this pie pan. And once it's in there, we're gonna form it. Again, we get to use our hands, yay! We're gonna <laughs> form it into a sweet potato crust shape. Once that's in there and it's formed pretty well, we're gonna put it into the oven for 30 minutes and we're gonna cover it with some tin foil so it bakes really well. So here's our handy piece of tin foil that we have ready to go. And we're just gonna put the tin foil on, put it in the oven, and then while that, that is cooking, we're gonna grab our onion and chop this bad boy up and get it caramelizing. So when it comes out, we can just put the eggs and our onion in there. Should be done so let's go grab them out of the oven and what we're gonna do next once we get it out is we're gonna let it sit for about 10 minutes just to let it cool down a little bit so be careful of the steam um, but we're just gonna remove that oh looking good you can see it's kind of getting all nice and crispy on the outsides and now we are going to prepare our egg mixture. So we'll come over here, we'll get out our eight eggs. We're gonna crack them in this bowl, and then we're just gonna whisk them with a little bit of salt and pepper. And this is so fun because you can season it up however you want. There's so many possibilities here. So pick your favorite spices and add them in. And then we're also gonna add into this mix our tomatoes and our spinach. And afterwards, when it's all done, we're gonna garnish with that beautiful avocado. I'm so excited for this. I've been waiting for this all day long. I know, it's gonna be so good. It's one of my favorites. And I know it's one of yours too. Let's grab our sweet potato crust and add our egg mixture. So your pan's probably gonna be hot still at this point, so make sure you use a nice oven mitt. And don't forget your piece of tin foil. Don't throw that out yet. So once we have this over here, put that down for right now and we're just gonna pour this beautiful mixture make sure you get all those goodies in there we're gonna pour that on top mmm looks so good kind of looks like Christmas so before we go and before we pop that in let's get these and add them and remember just leave a little extra for a garnish at the end just to make it look pretty so we're gonna add those those are gonna add a lot of flavor there you can also put garlic in too when you do these caramelized onions if you want to add even more flavor. So now that we have that, caramelized onions are intact. Covering it back up and then popping it back into our oven. It's that time. We're gonna get the frittata out of the oven and we're gonna remove the tin foil. So, we're just gonna come over here. You can see it's almost, almost completely done. Just a little bit in the middle there needs to cook. So we're gonna pop that back in for about 10 minutes and then it should be ready to eat. And we'll top it with our avocado. 
I'm pretty sure I smell something ready to come out of the oven. I think it's frittata. <laughs> you ready to come get this out? Yeah. So this, at this point, to be nice and baked and beautiful, we've got our browned sweet potato crust, our eggs, and now we're just gonna top it with avocado because what do we not put avocado on? We love this stuff. It's really good high on omega-3s. So we cut it long ways, and then I'm gonna try and do this very gracefully <laughs> and just fan it, fan it out, make it look pretty. Yeah, look at that. Oh, we'll get our final little bit of caramelized onions and we'll top that just like that. And once we do that, we can grab a knife, cut it up, serve it, and of course, enjoy it. I cannot wait to try a piece of this. Can you uh, dig on in there? Oh, of course. I would be happy to. So let's do a nice little dig in there. We gotta get you some avocado, and we gotta get you a little of that caramelized onion. Yes, please. Yeah, so if you like the recipe, and you want to see more like this, you can always subscribe here on YouTube. And then also check out my website, stephhendel.com, and you can sign up for my email newsletter. I send really exclusive stuff out there on uh, recipes, fitness, and then also some little secret stuff that I like to throw in just for everybody who subscribed. Uh, so find me on there, Instagram, and I'll see you in the next video.